Today we are talking about my top 10 JoJo stands. Let's get straight into it. Star Pressure, the world. Number 10, Tusk. How can someone not love this little elephant? I especially really like how it evolves over time. I think my favorite is either Tusk Act 1 or Tusk Act 4. I really like how the stand becomes super overpowered when Johnny uses the golden spin. I also really like how Tusk allows Johnny to shoot his nail bullets. Number 9, Stone Free. This stand on the surface doesn't seem like it can do much, but all of the creative ways Jolene manages to use her stand will surprise you. I love the glasses on this stand, it honestly makes it look so swaggy. One of the coolest things Jolene manages to pull off with her stand, however, has to be the Mobius trip. When I first read Stone Ocean, I literally couldn't believe my eyes. Number 8, Purple Haze. This stand gives me the chills. It always looks so intense, and it's also insanely powerful. I think if Fugo stayed with the main crew, they might have all survived just because of how overpowered this stand is. I also really like how hand in hand this stand is with Fugo's personality. Whenever a stand represents a person so well, I really like it. Number 7, Star Platinum. This has to be the most iconic stand there is. What is there not to love about it? I really like all of the different changes it goes through throughout the parts. I think part 4 Star Platinum is probably my favorite. Time stopping has got to be one of the coolest on-screen abilities though. The way it's animated is just so dope. Jotaro's time skip has got to be one of the most iconic things ever. You also can't forget about the Oda Oda Oda. That's got to also be one of the most iconic things ever. Number 6, Sticky Fingers. Zippers? I feel like with part 5, Araki became really creative with his stands. The Sticky Fingers is definitely one of those stands I don't think I would have ever came up with. But wow, do I love its usage. Being able to put a zipper anywhere and on yourself is so damn cool. Number 5, Wonder of You. This is the scariest stand ever. I don't think I'd ever want to be anywhere near this thing. I really love the mystery behind this stand and it's one of the reasons I love Jojolian so much. The way Toru is able to use his stand is really dope. The fact that they don't have to be near each other is like so menacing. Number 4, Kill a Queen. I don't know if it's Kira or his stand but I just have an insane feeling of love for them. The amount of personality they brought to part 4 was awesome. I still often yell, Kira Queen, Dyson no Bakuran bites the dust. I also really like how dangerous this stand is. Part 4 did a really good job building up how menacing Kira was. And I think explosions work as a perfect ability for him. Plus, it's a cat. I freaking love cats. Number 3, Gold Experience. Definitely one of the coolest abilities Araki has ever given to his stand. I don't even get me started on the stand's design. I thought regular gold experience already looked sick, and then it turned into Requiem, and both ability and design just became so much more dope. I also really love how we finally got another person who yells Muda while using his stand. Giorno being Dio's son in general is just one of the coolest plot points in JoJo. Number 2, Sex Pistols. This is the cutest stand ever. I think for the anime, they created the perfect voice for it. Anytime these little guys are on screen, I get a huge serotonin boost. I also really love their fighting style. Redirecting bullets is just so insanely sick. I really like how Araki took something simple like a gun which he had before as a stand in part 3 and just made it so much better. Number 1, Soft and Wet. My favorite stand ever. I just find everything about it so cool. The stand design is just too dope and I love how it mixes Joseph Ume and Kira's abilities into one. I think this thing just has an insanely cool battle presence. Any fight in Jojolian that Josuke is involved in is always just super enjoyable. I also love Go Beyond. As if Josuke wasn't menacing enough, they gave him an ability that makes him a top 3 strongest Jojo character. Anyway, that is my top 10 Jojo stands list. I would like to know what your top 10 is, so please leave that down in the comments below, and I'll see you in the next video.